of as soon as we passed from SIT, he wanted to become a lecturer and uh, he applied in a couple of uh, institutions. One is our uh, Siddhiranga Polytechnic and another is Government Polytechnic. And fortunately, he did uh, uh, get the opportunity to become a lecturer. But he did do hard through his uh, sheer hard work, uh, persuasion, and determination. Today he has become the director of one of the reputed R&D organization in India. So this, this shows life throws challenges, but we have to accept challenges. And when we overcome the challenges, we can easily reach our goals. Not only he personally has reached his goal, he is also encouraging all of his family to achieve their goals. Both his children are pursuing their studies at US universities. Even his wife is pursuing PhD in one of the US universities. We are all proud and congratulate Dr. Nagar May for all his The progress of any organization depends on the leader. We are fortunate and excited to have Dr. M. S. Janavasapha as our director, who is guiding us for our uh, success. And uh, even at his right age, he is uh, constantly thinking about the progress of our institution. And I thank you, sir. And on behalf of Mechanical Engineering Department, I welcome you for Momentum 19, 2019. And I do tell you that SIT has become one of the top 10 institutions in Karnataka and, is, uh, and has secured 78 place in, in, our, uh, in all of India. Our CEO is known for unbiased administration and is a strict disciplinarian. And he religiously follows our uh, motto of working for shit. I now welcome our uh, CEO, Dr. Shukumariya, for moment of 2020.
multiple and generous way through our association and this gift and this donation will be given to a person who is suffering from severe abdominal infection and is in need of financial help. I request our director Dr. M. L. Chandrabasa Pasar to hand over the chat to beneficiary Mr. Lakshman J. Sai Premau is present here. Every year, we organize a number of invited 
researchers from experts from academia or the institutions, industries, and we organize faculty development programs, seminars, conferences, and industry visits. The faculty of our department are actively involved in research in addition to teaching. Around 100 numbers of papers are presented and published in international conferences and journals. We have received research funding from various reputed organizations like ACT, GTRE, CPRI, BTU, VGST, Biofuel Task Force, ECTU, etc. With around 300 entries are registered, we had an overwhelming response. There has plenty of response from other institutions okay, for participation in various events today. We are uh, providing the registration of participants free of cost and we provide them free local hospitality. Our students are members of many clubs of the institute and actively take part in all the club activities. One of the major clubs is the CAESIP Collegiate Club, wherein the students participate in national and international competitions of SAE India and SAE International. The students are designed, fabricated, tested, and participated in competitions like Baja, that is auto and vehicles, Supra, Formula Racing Cars, and SAE Aero International at USA, which is more concentrated on unmanned aerial vehicles, that is UAVs. We are also involved in design and fabrication of hybrid bicycles. Our department has a multi-purpose bioenergy research, information and <coughs> demonstration center established by the government of Karnataka with the support of our management. The main objective of this plant is to train the rural mass in collection of suitable oil seeds and generation of biodiesel. Along with this, a lot of UG, PG and PhD research work is going on and many research papers are being published. The research generated is being used to run the college buses and also to run the, our generator, which is a captive power plant. Uh, enough revenue has been generated by selling the products like seed cake and glycerin to this department. Department of Mechanical Engineering strongly believes fruitful industry institute interaction. The department has over 20 uh, MOUs with industries, academic institutions like NITK, Sotical, BAT, Vellu, and organizations like uh, GTRE, CPRI, NAL, Bangalore. Students of second year and third year are encouraged to pursue industry internships during summer vacation and also carry out research and project works. Guest lectures from industry experts are regularly organized through academic sessions. ACT, INAE, uh, that is Indian National Academy of Engineering has approved the distinguished visiting professor uh, scheme of the department and nominated Dr. Kishore Kumar, joint director of GTRE Bangalore for the year 1516 and 1617. Some of the courses offered by industry experts in advanced areas at both UG and PG levels. I also congratulate, congratulate Dr. C. P. Lohit for publishing the book, The Enhancing and Competitiveness of Indian MSMEs through Innovation published by Lampard Academy Publishing in Germany. With the consistent and constant support from our beloved director, respected CEO, respected principal, health, uh, training and placement, and uh, deans, we are hopeful of achieving great heights of excellence and glory. Thank you, Madam.
These are all the young kids like new people. Very innovative. Right? I'm not explaining each of the results. You can Google it. There are reports out there. Maybe you can note down the sports. Uh, you come to know what about each technology. Only I want to, my purpose is you dream it is possible. Thanks. But still, if really ask as many as Indian citizens, do we have really Indian products? We have many to we can count in ads. Then what is the power? It means if you all agree that okay, product innovation is a challenge, then what are the challenges? This is a debatable thing. I just listed, uh, this would be there, you may accept, you may not accept. Our education system is there is a wrong. Because the guy after plus two is most highest marks like you or like me. And who could able to clear the endless exams, what of the high level, the high level, YAD, JE, and all, he will become an engineer. And the guy who could not do plus two, he will become a science graduate or arts graduate. Despite sorry, science graduates, arts graduates is a serious bachelor's degree, and engineering is four years. Just because of one year, we are getting BSc graduates as equal to diploma in all those equipment, even the government establishment now. I have been able to recruit BSc holder as a diploma, equal to diploma as a technical student, not as a scientist. And you always Science and engineering, we never talk to each other. We never expect. Believe me, innovation doesn't come unless you understand the science. But if you are only target to science, you are being a science graduate, restricted to science, you cannot engineer the product. This is where the thing is missing. Then, you are being taught that in these days is very complicated. Parents, teachers expect that you should score 98, not 95. This is the competition is there. No matter what knowledge you get, but it is a percentage based focus. Theoretical syllabus, curriculum is designed 10 years before. This is the base. I'm not blaming, I'm sorry, don't take it other. This is a fact. Uh, there is no active participation, active learning. And it is quite unfortunate. There are many engineering colleges, not affecting SIT is exceptional, because I hope to be a student of this college. Manufacturing is caused by God who never operated the business. This is a scenario in India. And social obligation affecting your all, there is no kind of supporting for our own passions. And second is, I always think how I, how I feed my son, how my son feeds to his son. At least, if all of us, we think for each generation, so taking risk is the really tough. Taking out signal to repeat to invest somewhere is a really challenge for Indians. And of course, there are limited resources. So that's why industries, particularly the small scale industry, is too hard innovation to call. Rather, you can, if anything, innovation is there in India, you only get out of too hard innovation because survival is the reality. But then they innovated, they on it has a major impact. And though this chart, this is the medium scale and large scale industry too, particularly the large scale industry who is cash rich companies. They believe in important technology rather than developing a technology. They can wait three years to take a decision to invest on technology, but they won't wait three or uh, three months for the researchers to develop a technology in India. There is some, okay, can you able to do it tomorrow? But otherwise he has already taken three years. And the poor networking, that is, because everyone has that throw on one approach. Because pocket layer fine, if pocket layer then also fine. Like it. This is what another reason our networks doesn't work. And there's no room for other speeds. Because everybody has an ego. The Indian people have a lot of egos. And one example I will quote you. Can you imagine in US? Hillary Clinton fought with Obama for the president's position. Later on, she accepted to work as a minister under him. Can you imagine that scenario in India? Then, social reasons, political, all those you should not discuss here. So, what is the evolution and revolution? 
So these are the definitions you can understand, but I will give apart from this, I will give one more example. Or you ask your forefathers, possibly you, your generation people are not seen, but you ask your fathers or maybe your uh, grandfathers. We used to carry suitcase, trunks, made, made out of a living. But we never thought putting wheel would make that easy. Today you won't find any trunks or suitcases without carrying wheels. This is what revolution. Right? So this island is over. So it is not required. Yeah. This is for you people. This is where as a student I miss. I am sure you are also missing. See, this is a water water. I am going to ask you questions. How many parts are there? Two. Huh? I wish four parts are made. What are those four parts? Water is not a part. Right? Can, cap, log, then fourth one? Sticker. Without sticker, you can't say it, right? Then these parts make the product. Next. Now, you, this is where we miss. Are these parts same parts? Made it by same material? Use same manufacturing process, does it cost same or is it necessary to make all the parts in house? Go to next slide. How many of us realize that your speckler we do regularly has 15 to 16 components? The accuracy requirement is fraction of my cost. Right? Again, there are different videos. Mental is there, polymer is there. Then strings are there. Lot of engineering is there. If you want to design this paper, I'm sure you all will fail. Now you can think of tomorrow when you got married, don't take your wife to buy a car. Because she needs everything that without cost. Right? How can you expect that this car like this, which is embedded with lot of sensors? which is have all car 15 parts. To make a car, you require 1,500 modes and dies. So this is what the complexity of the problem. Next. These are all sensors. Now our human bodies are also embedded with a lot of sensors. This is what my nano people uh, show. Invariably, this type of testing, many people have done it. That's the first way I got it. Right? So now you can think of the sensors which is going inside. Maybe you can ask your father, even I went to the once, uh, once uh, the endoscopy. People used to inside 10 millimeter camera inside here. Now you go, the smallest endoscopic camera available is 1.6 millimeter. Next. So electronics is all happened, the, the revolution. I don't know whether you remember most luck. Now most has become a reality. Right? So devices are made by handheld with multifunctional capabilities. Next. We make prime manufacturing systems have been much organized and reconfigurable. And to that extent that factories have become clean room labs. Because we CMT have this kind of labs and factories have been of portable factories, mobile factories. That means this is the factory which I showed that was developed in a real mechanical engineering laboratory in Japan, uh, which can be packed in a suitcase and carried. Next. But please remember, we have to deal with this. There is no shortcut for innovations. If you really you are interested in product innovation. Invariably, you have to address this 5x. Just a minute, which is, so to remember I made here. You have to talk about geometry, no matter whether it's a micrometer or the nanometer or the macro scale. You have to work on product is designed for a specific functions, for specific users. And you need to understand the science behind this. The mass momentum, uh, Equations if you go to the way what? So those are the questions normally people ask.
and the physics behind the application as well as the environment and then the cost that is industry aspect. So you have to deal with these five years if really if you want to engineer the product. In the new product development cycle, as I said, it's a always a step. There are range of prototypes is required. So prototypes can be category, category, four category, analytical prototypes, physical prototypes, compliance, you want to focus. These are the domains. Actually, the first quadrant, uh, this part, physical and compliance is the complex. This is where a lot of technologies emerge with respect to ensuring that we are using the prototype. Now, this is called ready manufacturing. So, what it means, alpha, beta, this is the beta version is released. It's easy to understand in terms of software, but it's true even in mechanical engineering. If you need to develop a product, you need to want to go. People cannot use alpha beta version, they call first generation, second generation, third generation, but it's true. It's same like alpha beta now. Since I'm from manufacturing, specialized in manufacturing area now, so no matter what technology is true, still metal cutting theory which was used in storage. What is the basic requirement in metal cutting? What basic requirement? Otherwise, you can't do it. Students, what is the basic requirement for metal cutting? You have to remove the material. Very gently. So it's a factor. You need a device, I don't want to call it as a tool, which has wet shape. Even today, cutting tool geometry is still is a wet shape. You are forcing wet, steel, wet, wet shape to, to the workpiece, then only sharing will take place. I am working on micro manufacturing, nano manufacturing. My current manufacturing capability, even in CMTF, we are able to create by machine up to 7 nanometers, and sorry, smallest, yeah, smallest, 7 nanometers. Still, here is same. Wet shape to is forced against the sound. Right? So please accept this, this theories, fundamentals, immense say you can't overlook this. But study for scoring 95 or 98, try to understand the subject. Yeah, as I said, all the manufacturing process, you name any manufacturing process, we can broadly categorize into these rows. Either you are removing a material, shaping a material with change, with the top face change, adding a material, and the new addition to mechanical engineering is kind of assembly of water, mostly chemistry we are doing, they call self-assembly, self-organization, and the half biomanufacturing. This will not disappear what it all. At least when I was engineering, I didn't know. What is this? What? Deming cycle. Because by a scientist, not deming. Right? This you have to do. That's what I mean. Right? There is no shortcut. Next slide. I intentionally skip this slide. This is actually the fact. Academia, industry, and the investor. Uh, academia, R&D, and the investor. Why these three guys work thought together? He will say, the academia will say, practical based learning, PPL. It is not my domain. It was not done earlier. Why I should bother now? Please, the engineering company. Excellent. And the side is, who happens to be made of solid, interested in solving an equation, you will say, how can I do it? How can you learn the math? Next. It doesn't work in engineering. Next. The funding agency or the funding institute funder, so we can't afford it. Who, how can I, where can I build a so, uh, facility where my students can go and go training or practical training? But this guy, good guy, who is invested, 
will say he has to face with this. How could he take the spirit for people? How I motivate? How I engage them the job which they like because of that people are becoming software developer and you are having a mechanical degree and you are developing a software for asset management. And this is not uh, international study, a lot of studies going behind this. It has been well recognized. What about 40 minutes, 45 minutes, teachers dance in front of the school will be useless unless you convey the message within 10 to 15 minutes. Because in the period of uh, 45 to 1 hour, only students can absorb 10 to 15 minutes. This is a challenge behind this different of the faculty. This is not just a This, of course, was a seen. So you appreciate this, you try to do this because knowingly or by parents force you are in engineering, you want to be in engineering, you have to be practical. So this is what I hear at Berlin. I see I remember. And I do, I understand. Next, this is then in Google, right? I don't know if you must have done about it. We just try to attempt, I'll give you 10 seconds. How many of you can able to do it? I'll show the answer. How can you do it? So we need to draw a line outside the dots. See, this. you have, because we have been taught that I have to follow, connect these four points without lifting a pen. That means we are always looking at only those four points. Unless you look beyond this, you can't do it. This is more popular of a course if you Google it. Many versions of this are there. This is a book for you. So now I'll just say the day I joined here, I was kind of normal, very, very normal student. I came from Dorot College in Kumpo. And I did engineering just to convince my father that I want to do engineering. I didn't take food three days. So now you can imagine what was my background. It's not that you don't want. It was not affordable to me. And the only person, the same person, I got to see him in BBT down here, he's in college, 3,000 rupees for the fees. And I came here, I paid 2,000 rupees for the fees. Visual class. That's the condition I want for what came out. Now, this is the last slide. This is what I want to tell you. Now, what I want to tell you, there was always, there was a Shishikuma said, Shishika said, yes, I want to be a faculty because my village, we are, there are even today about 400 teachers out there. I understand only teaching. I am the first engineer from my village. 250 families in village. I am the first engineer from my village. So naturally I am no only teacher. Even if I remember, possibly I don't know that was there when I became a PhD holder. There was a high school teacher, he asked me, Chandraya, dear Chandraya. He asked us, he always says, Jeevan and Pundu Guri Rani Guri Geta Kada Shavari. He was to teach a model. He asked us, tell me to you what you want to become. I wrote the way I wrote. I wrote that I want to do PhD in mathematics. The reason was mathematics was my favorite subject in high school. And somehow it is there I want to do PhD in mathematics and teach. Because that time I didn't know what is it. Right? So this is how I reached the so last 20 years. I was able to my primary area is I work in my class system engineering. Although after some period I was working on more designs and all. In more centers I developed the industry. But otherwise my all other research contribution is in this area. This is my current institute. I am graduate to the this institute. Whatever I have done research. Because it's here I am not doing any research. Now I am managing. So whatever research is done, it's done in CM. We are the only one institute that is. I just over you for this was our domain, our my group which I established with one person. Now this group has 24 researchers, 40 PhDs, 40 PhD students. I started this group in 2004, four, actually partly in already in 2004. These are few projects which we developed in my group. Uh, 
we developed a range of my conditions where I was looking after. And also we worked on few devices like that, for a nanometer based on the filter. And we also made a point of view, which is an alternative to your fluorescent battery. So and micro fluid is uh, lab on chip devices. These are the few machines which I developed. Next. I'm skipping because uh, time is not there. And this is the micro factory which I demonstrated at the uh, CME array. You can have four functions and you'll be able to generate up to nano, uh, sorry, 100 micro factors. But while doing this, this is what I said. Both being a national lab, working in both machines, prototypes, was our priority. We, I did not neglect the scientific aspect. So all these science aspects, some of the aspects which we are the first to report. So for example, parallel part, multi, uh, multi electrode EDM, that's our new concept. And optical emission of emission spectroscopy of micro EDM plasma that was reported by first by me. So those are the kind of things we have started, of course, fortunate. There are about 65 students whom I hired from the other projects, they were only three. And I also ensure that all these, now I will tell them about 10 students are faculty is there, otherwise 50 other students left, and I ensure that all 50 got the job before I leave my group. That's how I work, and that's the only thing that I created, even today I don't have my own house. So right, these are all different aspects. That means you have to get into the science aspect, you have to understand. No, you are developing a machine, but unless you understand the science, it's not possible. Next. So like as as the directly breaks down, how spark generates on it, see microseconds and all. Next. So, I'm just skipping some of them. I can move it, some of my papers are available. Next. This is a micro rotation holding. So what is a micro factory? I will just give you micro factory. So if you go to the next slide, this was designed four stage, and you can configure the micro factory without also doing even single screw. There is no screw in there. You can configure this factory for various products. But this, as I said again, there is no shortcut. I started with this first machine I made by Radio. Then I made a micro factory. I didn't find the tinker. For building micro EDM that machine, I spent about 25 lakhs. To build micro factory, I spent about 60 lakhs. And then, this is of course micro factory. But there is no taker. And my director started asking me, Baya, what you are doing? Because this group I started, my own. Then I made that machine. That cost market price 2 lakhs. We transferred 5 technology before I leave CME there. Now 5 is just costing 5 lakhs, rupees, 2 lakhs rupees. Right? This is what, if you start to stay in the first one or the second one, definitely this will not be I will give you one, my own example. I made a dry oxygen phase mask which is used by pirates. Uh, I made a dye, and this is a complex dye I made, it's a floating core, there is no reference at all. And there is an ant mode because guy was in that back. What uh, back in the company. And we made it, I supplied it also. And we did what? Why did it work? Because I designed things for all equations and then CNC machine all. And the guy which was a practical guy, what he was doing is he using a free process rubber sheet. And this is by compression molding. And even to, you cannot ensure that you will roll only 2 millimeter every time. You just carry chapati, he needs to roll and put it on the dial. And he has wrote a mail to my director. This dial was mail. He has come, so and so has committed 3 months, but he delivered at 6 months. And this bit of fact, and delivered at 6 months. Thereafter, dial is not working. And it was big. Angama in the department, in the institute, even people started asking, talking in a canteen. So this is the scenario, and this letter has come. Then I went, don't believe, 12 hours, 
I didn't give you much money. Just to demonstrate that. So that means if you are able, if you are able to create that signal, that means your pattern is creating that top frame element. Means it is only because of your work. Don't tell me your teachers. And uh, this is another project. Uh, still, it is going on because I started with uh, when I was in CMI. Now again, I continued as a mentor. This is a multi-institutional project, right? There are several schemes. This is funded by the ESP. This is a completely major project. We wanted to build a spot only for the people like you who is a 25 years old boy or girl who spent 25 lakhs and can have a maybe with a bedroom like 25 feet square area, you can able to establish a property which can able to last one day, only me. And this is our objective, we always have objectives for this group. This group is also like that, we have a mathematician, the second, third lady, Savitri, she is a mathematician. And we have a computer engineer, we have a mechanical engineer, and also we have a college and you can see the true parity of the transition. And my industry is also there. Thanks. Okay, this is, uh, this is what basically you want to do. This is IoT involvement of one manufacturing industry code. This is a project on the project where we are doing. Next. This is what I said, 45 years old, 25 years, 25 square meter area, and 25 lakhs. But doing this again, I emphasize here, you have to get into this much details. You may not believe we are all friends. In that group, it's fortunately five or students of the Mr. Tony. My, uh, that group, are all of us We practically fight on the blackboard. This is also like, it's written by somebody else. This is true with what is the what is the mean is back to project is in the north way and I hope this then the big data analysis foundry engine also we are developing. Now and last part for your audit exceeded uh, it takes only three minutes. Uh, CMPA is an autonomous institute where I am now leading this lab. Uh, this lab is started in 1962 at the Central Mission Co Institute, CMTI. Today it's at CMTI, so it has been renamed as Central Manufacturing Technology Lab in 1962. It is now currently under the official control of the uh, Heavy Industry Department of Heavy Industry. This lab, as I said, machines and manufacturing process is about 4 billion. And we closely work with academia industry. For the academia, for tier three, we won't work on the technology below tier three, that is the We work on technology ready level. There is a table 04519. I can over it, you will come to know what is tier one, tier and two. So we work tier three on the table up to tier six. That is the idea. That is why we work for R&D, we call our research technology and training and application. This is what our focus is. See, as I said, 1962 this lab started and CMT has a good impact, significance in the growth of the manufacturing technology. CMT was the first to introduce CNC machines in India. So, like that, we are now Possibly we are the one of the four. We are establishing a smart factory in CMTI. Maybe after two years, we will have five smart factory in CMTI established based on the technology which is developed in India. I made it no import as well. The day I took over, I said in this project no import. We will develop all the technology in us. That's how we started. Next. This is all about we undertake research, develop technology and machines, not necessarily machines we should do, but including equipment and subsystems, and train manpower on deploying to industrial application. I can proudly say possibly CMT is the lead 
but for our very few institutes, we will never talk about prototype. We will make a machine, we make a system which works in place. There is no, that is what the pressure which we have, or scientists have, there is no question of failure. For that, there is also negative aspect to that, we are built into that. But otherwise, this is the pressure we have. We need to make a prototype and you can name any strategy program of India, CMJS can do that. I can't be much needed, but GSLV, Chandrayana, Mars, Stages, everywhere CMJS can do that. GSLV, which is successful, their prototype was mixed by a mixer which was made at CMJ campus. So, this is why we are 72 scientists and primary engineers, about six, seven people are there in the science chemistry platform. And technicians means diploma and IJ together, we have 91. And non technical, uh, 50. And project assigned like college passouts. We also recruit people like you who passed out for a project for a short term. Uh, to people, if anybody join us under the project, Initially, we recruit you for two years, primarily for the project purpose. And in case you could not find or you are performing well, then what we will do is we will retain you another two, three years, but not temporarily long beyond five years. They are, like that, we have about 50 engineers, quite many engineers, and few scientists. As of today, we have about 250 crore projects. I'm fortunate March is very good to me. I got 160 crore project this month only.
and also some systems which are goes as a part of the machine. Next one. These are centrifugal machines for a vacuum scale. Like parallel kinematic machine, it is double of this whole kind of machines. Next. And we also do the textile machines, APM loop. Still in India, old way. Our machine we are now testing. And also we made test tricks for gas phase analysis. We are working on changes on all these projects. Um, we are primarily working on Galileo systems and testing and testing. And we also develop test tricks for machine tools. And then the technology like vision based technology is now to activity, MEMS and all. So we also developing some sensors and also Based, uh, technology solution. But in the manufacturing, uh, right now we have not built a machine. This is a primary we focus on metal and tin. We have two machines, uh, possibly more or less things have been placed in the right place. Uh, we are going to build a metal and tin machine which is capable of 1.5 meters length. This is we are working with the three big people and we are going to build this machine. And this is another program, uh, maybe you people uh, watching out, you are now about in hospital today. These are four centers in a part of the industry established. One at CFTA and one at IASC, one at IIT Delhi and another is the Oscar. This is for industry for technology. Each center focused on different domain. IAC, for example, more of artificial intelligence and how the state is there. And uh, IIT Delhi more focused on automotive. And our center is more of machine tool, as I said. We want to develop, demonstrate smart factory based on the technology developed in India. We decided not to go in there. What we developed is this. This is a Tukta sketch. We want to develop a smart factory like this, converting the legacy machines into a smart machine. And developing a protocol to connect machine to machine and connect the machine console to cloud and deploy the data analytics to artificial intelligence and then apply the operation management. These are the techniques we want to develop with industries, now LIT technologies and the Uttula technologies. There are two companies that have already joined to this achievement. And if any of the MPEG students interested to do projects related to this and willing to stay minimum six months in the campus, then there are a lot of problems which we could offer in this area. We don't need to spend anything. We had a display of this machine. It's a 5 axis machine, 15 years old machine. We converted to a smart machine by embedding these sensors modules for a different task. The reason is if you go to the company who operates in Vinya, like the job shop, and you tell him that I have a solution for smart machine manufacturing on industry board, he won't even look at it. But if you look at it, I have a solution, don't invest in it, don't change your living financing facility. But this solution will ensure you of the harassment of speed on time by 10%, then only it will ask you to see. So this is what the practical problems which we just faced. So we focused on that. So without changing your legacy machines, then we are able to make your machines smart machines. As I said, there are many problems. We prefer them to take to stay at least six months, but we take only internship, but we will not be able to much of this particular this but there are other domains where there are opportunities that exist. These are two types <coughs> of one And this is the anti manufacturing machine being converted into a remote area bird. A mobile ops is developed even I can operate that machine by from here. So those kind of solutions we develop and we have not imported any other technology. It's all our own technology developed by our own solution. And the guy who has developed this machine just joined three years before. Like you, it's a bit of a
as I said, capacity building is more important. Possibly the other reasons yet uh, as a touring facilities, world class facilities. <coughs> This is, in summary, this is my last, last time, last first, last last slide. The next five, six years, CMA will be like this. These are the focus domains. And the, these are the new initiatives. We are going to establish smart manufacturing cell, center of excellence for textile machinery. And there will be uh, initiative. If this initiative is true, definitely I will come back to you as a partner. Level. Right now it is not there as an innovative issue for manufacturing I Q M. This is a Ministry of Defence program. There are seven centers are coming up. One center is at CMTI, which will be working on these three focus domains. Already these are partners. The reason was right now partnership is restricted for the government establishment. And we are going to have second type of collaboration. That time I definitely come back to the SIT. So we have this.